Hello everyone, Nevika here. Welcome to this next episode of Let's Play Judgment. So in the last episode, we got some sweet justice, literally. And here in the in 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 this law office here. And you know what? I should see if they have any uh, side cases for me here. I heard someone got shot at the Matsugane family office last night. Yeah. Was it someone you knew? Nah, just a name I'd heard. Wait, were you actually worried about me? No, not at all. I think she was. I heard someone got shot. Yeah, was no. no. Nope, I guess no cases. Hey, Yagami. Are you butting heads with Hamura? He called me to complain about it. Said to keep your nose out of his case. Oh, sorry about that. Fine by me. Just wanted to make sure you're okay. I'm good. He's a little preoccupied now, anyway. There was a shooting at the Matsugane family office. Yeah, I heard. This damn city gets rougher every day. You telling me? All right. Guess we're done here. Let's go. See, I know we're supposed to meet with Higashi, but I want to make some friends and then start this job right here. Hehe. <laughs> well, let me let me start that job already, actually, because the side cases can be long, and they are more important. Oh, I didn't even notice that screw. Awesome. So. Where's the case? In here? Someone waiting here? No? There's a friend here, but not yet. We must meet this person. Where are they? Maybe in the top floor? Nope. Is there any other floor? Ooh, sixth floor. Alright. Here then, yep. Okay. Excuse me. Are you Hayama san? I'm Detective Yagami. Ah, I've been waiting for you, Yagami san. Thanks for making the trek. Please come in. The man of the hour is right this way. Hmm? The man of the hour? Yeah. He's the reason I made this request, or I guess you could call him the problem in a lot of ways. Right then. Let's just start at the beginning. Soto. Ah, Shijima-kun. I told you there's no smoking here. Huh? Oh, shut it, will you? I apologize, Yagami-san. You shouldn't have had to see that. It's fine. Care to introduce us? This is Otoya Shijima, an artist associated with our talent agency. Hmm? What kind of artist? Oi. Wait, you don't know who I am? What kind of remote mountain village are you from that you haven't heard of me? <sighs> uh, sorry. I don't have time to watch much TV. Soto. Don't be rude, Shijima-kun. I apologize, Yagami-san. Don't sweat it. Why don't you take a seat, Hayama-san? So what can I do for you today? Well, it's about the performance Shijima's going to be doing in Kamurocho. It would have been fine, but he's being hounded by a scandal of sorts. Of sorts? We knew he had a bad rep when he signed him, but some of his past... Indiscretions have come to light in recent days. So what if I used to ride motorcycles over sidewalks with my crew and stuff? <laughs> and I mean, I guess we snatched a few things for shits and giggles. Uh. So, reckless endangerment and theft. Oh, come on! It was more than ten years ago. I read online that it's past the statute of limitations. <sighs> well, you could start by at least pretending to be sorry. The timing is unfortunate. I think this event is going to draw quite a crowd of reporters. But that would ruin the whole performance, especially if he's caught by them. I understand the situation, I suppose. 
but I still don't get how I fit in. Yes, about that. We'd like to ask you to... Well... Be the decoy for Shijima. Hmm? Wait... What? It's simple. You dress up like me and draw the attention of the annoying media flies away from me. Then I don't get held up by them and I can go on stage as planned. Hmm. Sure, but if you haven't noticed, you and I have some very different looks going on. We've taken that into account, actually. Shijima-kun, I brought your outfit. Huh? I have to wear it right now? It'll make this go quicker. What a pain in the butt. I don't follow. It's going to change, so just give us a second. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. What in the world? He's in a new vampire drama, you see, and he'll be taking the stage in costume. I am Bram Shilvania And I have returned from the deepest depths of hell. Offer unto me your pulsing blood. <laughs> I guess he's really into the part. He's a method actor. Wait, didn't you say this performance was outdoors? You going to be okay in all that direct sunlight? <laughs> <laughs> I am the progeni progenitor vampire. Sunlight cannot rend my flesh. Hmm? Wait a second. You're not expecting me to wear this ludicrous outfit, are you? Unfortunately, we are. Of course you are. Oh my god, interview a <laughs> detective. <laughs> A little nod to the movie. All we need you to do is wear this and get the attention of the reporters. We'll make it worth your time. Would 140,000 yen be suitable? Fine. As long as it's just to get their attention. Right. You should probably know that. Offer unto me your pulsing blood. Is Bram's catchphrase, just in case. Oh my god, offer unto me your pulsing blood. Okay. I'm not sure you're paying me enough to say that. The venue is right in front of Komuro Hills. Kamuro Hills, so stop by when you're ready, Yagami-san. Oh god. Okay, I guess it's vampire time. I'll head to the plaza in front of Kamuro Hills. Oh man, this is too funny. Where's Kamuro Hills? Is it that? No. Right? Where's Kamuro Hills? Oh, there you go. No. no. That's not it, is it? Is it? Um, where's Kamuro Hills? Kamuro, Kamuro, Kamuro. So it has to be that? I don't know, I guess. We'll see. Go to the hills garden? Oh. Hmm. We go now to the bombing incident in Kamurocho where it seems we have an update on the device found at the scene. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's the bomb! They're still looking into that bombing! According to Lee release police reports, the bomb was handcrafted and included a remote controlled timer. The police are continuing to search for any evidence that may lead to the culprit. Citizens are encouraged to call the police should they see any suspicious persons or unattended bags. In other news, the baby panda born last month continues to show healthy and grow healthy growth and so basically they're still hoping to find a lead. Oh gosh, we went into a different side case. A block number, great. Could it be from the bomber? Answering this could lead to trouble, but should I? I guess I won't. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I think I have to. Oh. Answer the withheld call. Oh, I didn't answer it. <laughs> no, I'm not ready yet. I'm guessing it's this one. I'm gonna go. That case can wait. I'm not ready. We're in the middle of another case. You wait, stupid bummer. Okay, okay, we're going this way. Oh, don't know what that sound was. Oh, I already forgot the line. I'm sure I'll recognize it once I see it. So, here then? I'm assuming, yep. I hope this is it. I don't want to start another side quest by accident. I hope it's this one. Yes, yes it is. I just have to wait until Bram Sama's concert starts. Wait. Wait! Couldn't hurt to nap, I guess. <laughs> There's a ton of media gathered in front of the venue. Yanami-san! Excuse me. Hayama-san, so this is still really happening, I take it? Hi. Of course! There's no backing out now, okay? Nah. Just thought I'd ask. Shijima will be arriving in a tinted car soon, but as you can see, the media are prepared to ambush him. Hmm. You weren't kidding. Yes, they'll swoop in on Shijima as soon as they catch even a glimpse of him. That's why we need you, Yagami-san. You have to keep their eyes on you. Here's the Bram outfit. So this is what it feels like to sink to a new low. Oh gosh, right here, right now, I just change? Okay, I'm just gonna appear out of nowhere. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, he looks awful. Excuse me. Um, Hayama-san. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, it doesn't, it doesn't even look like him. <laughs> wow, you guys look identical. Okay, Yagami-san, let's draw the media toward you. So I have to call them over with the catchphrase. Here we go. Right you are, Yagami-san. Be as dramatic as you can when you say it, please. All right, here goes nothing. I want to suck your blood. <laughs> this one. Offer unto me your pulsing blood. Hmm? It's Bram Summer. Ah. Wow, they took the bait. Let's go. Yeah. Us too. Yamasan, we have to run before they catch us. Oh my god. Crap, I wasn't fast enough. The others will get to him before. Hmm? Yeah. Ah! Hmm? Uh. Crap! <laughs> uh oh. That was easy. <laughs> uh oh. Damn it! I'm surrounded. Bramsama! Do you deny the report swirling around all the damage you and your motorcycle gang have caused? Did you steal from people too? Is it all true? Uh, this isn't supposed to be happening. It's come to this. Just deal with these questions as best you can. Oh my god. Huh? What? Mm. All you have to do is answer them like Bram Sama would. Oh, but he's an ass. Like the fictional vampire I know nothing about would. Okay. Oh, okay, not the real person. The vampire? Oh my god. I was practicing evil deeds. A vampire's. I was practicing evil deeds. <laughs> well, considering I am darkness incarnate, the crimes of my past are simply practice for my future evil deeds. Hmm? Practice? For evil? Think upon it. 
If I was an upright citizen, would that not be more scandalous for a vampire? But Bram Sama, incredible. What? You can't just run away from your past. Wow, you sounded just like Bram Sama. But I think you might have gone a little overboard. Sorry. This vampire thing sucks. Oh, okay. <laughs> I am the immortal vampire, above all judgment and laws by any scandals past or present. Huh? Humanity means nothing to me. Your blood is the source of my limitless power, and I have thrived on it for centuries. Uh, uh, I don't think that's the question I was asking. Yagami-san, you had the Brahmas, the Brahm summer vibe down, but the timing is terrible. The one who told me to talk like a vampire. Huh? No more messing around. You're not off the hook just because the statute of limitations expired. That's right. Bram Summer's theft has driven entire corporations out of business. What? That's not true, is it? Are you just going to keep dodging the responsibility? Don't expect saying sorry will solve all your problems. Ugh. Crap, what do I do? I'll return the money. I shall personally apologize to each and every one of my victims. How would you even do that? That motorcycle gang rampaged, rampaged all over Kanto. Huh? Did, did we now? Trying to apologize to everyone you're wrong sounds pretty unrealistic to me. If an apology is no good, what should I do? In that case, I shall atone for my sins with money. How would you pay back the people from the past then? So many fans are in deep pain over this incident. This isn't something you can just pay your way out of. This is hurting them at the heart. The heart? I have left my weak human heart in the deepest pit of hell. You monster! This is exhausting. Yes, but you see, I have also considered community service. Huh? What kind? Hmm. You know, consoling the elderly, picking up trash around Kamurocho, that kind of thing? Wow! Bramsama is going to perform for the elderly? Bramsama is going to pick up trash around the city? Oh. Did that one actually work? Are you serious about all this? Of course! A vampire who breaks his word is cursed! This could go viral. Maybe this is his chance to turn things around. Was that a bad answer? Well, it seems to be working regardless. Oh my god, that dude's gonna get mad at us. Huh? Yes. Oh, great. It sounds like he made it into the venue just fine. Nice. Glad it worked out. But are these guys going to let me go? <laughs> oh, we're gonna run away. Okay. Excuse me. Hey, Bram Sama, I still have some questions. Damn, uh, I have to make. Okay. Um, this way? No. Into the van we go. Nope, alright. Um. Cloud through? Nope. <laughs> How do I make a stealthy escape? Uh, it's not letting me do anything else. Okay. Don't quite understand what they want me to do. Oh, oh, maybe I gotta change, right? Uh, see if it works. Watch I like automatically fail. <laughs> Uh, work clothes, yes? 
Oh, just working. Huh? Where's Bramsama? That's weird. He was just here a second ago. He is vampire after all. <laughs> you did great, Yagami-san. I'm glad it's done. Oh, that guy's gonna be so mad at us. <laughs> My adoring sacrifices, thank you all for gathering here today. Now, offer unto me your pulsing blood. Phew, I'm glad he made it on stage. But I think he should probably know what I said. <laughs> so that's what happened. You're getting right? Community service! Why do you rope me into something so stupid? I think it's great, actually. <laughs> Huh? This will be a very public way to show how sorry you are. B but this sounds lame. Think about it though. You could gain new fans and impress lapsed ones all in one fell swoop. Uh... True. Hey, I know. Why don't we just pay this guy to do it for me? Ha! <laughs> With all due respect, I'm not going to atone for your mistakes in your place. Sure, I got you into this mess, but I wouldn't have had to if you hadn't been a punk in the past. <clears throat> what? Yagami-san is right, Shijima-kun. As an artist, as an adult, it's up to you to face your past and atone for it. <sighs> Come on. Yep. Very deserving, actually. I enjoyed that very much. And we got a nice chunk of money for it, too. <laughs> yes, I shall not allow chaos to sow its seeds upon the beautiful world. <laughs> I swear upon my immortal life that I shall atone. Wow, Bramsama! Oh my god. I'm admittedly impressed that he can just turn it on like that. Yagami-san, thank you so much. As you can see, I think we're making real progress here. I just hope he'll consider what the consequences of his actions were and move forward as a better person. I agree. And Yagami-san, please don't let him discourage you from supporting Brahm-sama's journey moving forward. Yep. Oh, sure. He drank enough of my blood today to make me a convert. But big fan, he, right here. Offer oh, unto me your pulsing blood. Wow, Rapsam, I love you. <laughs> yes, one million. I'm a rich bitch. Yay. Um, I wanted to speak to some friends. Which friends? Well, here's one for sure. Miharu! She's there! <gasps> oh my gosh! Maybe we can finally get them together! Where was it? Oh, oh, so, so sorry. So sorry! Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm a, I'm a klutz, I know. Okay, here we go. Hey! Ooh, goody first. Hey, welcome back, Yagami-san. Hey. Miharu-chan, how are you? <laughs> Same as always. I'll show you to your seat now. Let's see if the guy followed the Yagami system. So, have you found your special someone? Well, no. I haven't really met anyone new. Oh, wait. There is this other part-time worker named Norimoto-kun that may be kinda interesting. Ooh, yay! Nice! 
Get in there, Norimoto-kun. A fellow part-timer, you say? Yep. I didn't have much of an impression of him at first. But as we were t started talking, he actually seemed pretty cool. Well, isn't that a nice coincidence? Mr. Wright has been here all along. Mm, I wouldn't say that just yet. But it would sure be nice. <laughs> Yay. Thanks for the meal. See you again. Thank you for coming, Yagami-san. Yay. Well, he's not... He hasn't scored yet, but... He's getting close. He's, he's getting closer to it. He went a step in the right direction, at least. He got noticed. Okay, let's go to... Uh, let's go to these people. Let's try to not to run into the bomber. Zibome. Let's try another piece of cake. Piece of cake. Ooh, can we even? Don't even know if we can. Nope. Gosh darn it. Alright, never mind. Let's see, where else did I want to go? Let's go to over here. Oh, hey, do you got something for me? Oh no, no, I don't think they do. No, leave me alone. I guess we're gonna fight. Yay! Teamwork. Bye, Ryan. Okay. Hey, what's up, my man? Oh no, nothing to say to me, alright. Uh, where was I gonna go? This way. Oh, Yagami-san, you're right on time. And you're... Furuya-san from Wet Kitchen, right? Yes, I wanted to thank you for your participation earlier. So I submitted your idea to corporate and they were so impressed, they greenlit it right away. Yay! Wow, they're really going through with it? Yes, except for one problem. They can't decide on which store to work with. After all, we're basically asking our rivals to cooperate with us. Not many stores are open to that idea. Yeah, can't imagine it'd be easy. Hmm, what to do? Maybe I should be on the lookout for the kind of restaurant he needs. I should help him out plenty. I will be on the lookout. Okay. Cool beans, cool beans. Let me go to... Hana e Ita. Domo. Domo. You're welcome. Is it time for another picture? Irashimase. Welcome. Ah, it's you, sir. Hey. Hey, how's our smile snapshot doing? Well, actually, <laughs> it's been chosen for the very best smile award. Congratulations. What can I say? It's all thanks to you. My very own smile sensei. <laughs> you seem like you're a perfect fit for our next smile intern. <laughs> Not gonna happen. Aw, come on. Well, you're welcome to submit an application if you ever change your mind. In the meantime, I'll be doing my part for by greeting every guest with the biggest smile I got. Yay! Yeah. And I'll come by every now and then just for that. Oh, that's right. I need to show you what's on the secret menu now that you won. Yeah, what do I get? You get... 
the legendary smile set. If it doesn't fix your smile in place, then it doesn't belong in your face. Now then, how can I help you? What smile set? Where is it? Oh, that's cool. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, that I would love that right now in real life, actually. Uh. Yay, we made another full friend. Let's see, let's go here. Ooh, oh my god, I didn't even, I didn't even get it. <laughs> Is it in here? Oh yes, it's this girl. Hi, Yagami. Please let me know if you need anything. Am I imagining this or did you get really fluent in English? Hi. Nope, it's all real. I'm glad it's not just me who thinks so. Wow. Looks like all your practice has finally paid off. I'm sure that's part of it. But actually, <laughs> would you believe if I told you I got a non-Japanese boyfriend? Huh? Whoa, that was quick. <laughs> he was staying at the hotel when we first met. When I tried to speak to him in English, he replied in Japanese. And it's been smooth sailing ever since. We're basically studying each other's language, so we help each other learn. Well, they do say the quickest way to learn a language is to find yourself a lover. Hi. Maybe so. Though I still can't say with confidence that I'm a true English speaker just yet. But, as long as I keep putting what I study into practice, I feel like I'm getting closer to my dream. You'll get there sooner than you think. I'll be rooting for you. Hi. You're a really helpful guy, you know that? Another full friend. Wow. Hmm? You'd still have to pay for it, but I came up with a new recipe. Ooh, what? We only have a limited amount of ingredients, so we can't serve it to the public, but we'll make an exception for you, of course. You sure that won't be too much of a hassle? Not at all. It's the least I could do to show our appreciation. What is it, though? Molten cheese tart? That's, that's probably it. Cool. Yay! <laughs> we made so many friends today. Anyway, this is a good place to stop this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. Side quests and a lot of friendships. Um, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please give it a like, comment below your thoughts, share the video, and subscribe to this channel for more episodes into this series. Until the next one, you take a lot of care. Jenny!